What's up, G-Brakes crew? It is G-Brakes Tech Ryan here, and today we have the new G-Brakes Harley Davidson in here. What we are gonna be filming is some tips and tricks on installing the front rotors on these bikes. Now remember, when you are installing or removing the front wheel, make sure you contact your manufacturer or your user manual and you follow the proper procedure. All right guys, now we are going to be removing the rotor here. This is a G-Brakes rotor, you will notice. Yours may look slightly different than this. You may be running a different aftermarket series or in switching to us or running the OEM. This is the standard Harley-Davidson five bolt design. So we will be removing all five of these Torx bolts. So now that we've got the bolts removed, we are gonna remove this rotor here. And we want to make sure this hub surface is very clean and that there is no debris on there that is going to get between the new rotor mating surface and the hub mating surface. All right, guys, I have just put on a fresh set of gloves here. We want to make sure we do not contaminate this new rotor before it goes on the wheel. I have also pre-washed this rotor. What we recommend using is just some Dawn dish soap and some warm water. That seems to work the best. Now we will be installing this rotor on this wheel. All right, so I did snug these down. They are not torqued. Even when snugging them down, make sure you do snug them down in a star pattern there. You're also gonna wanna contact either the manufacturer or the manufacturer of the wheel if you're running an aftermarket wheel and get the torque spec for the wheel and always use an approved torque wrench. And when we torque, we are also going in a star pattern. So I started here, I'm going over here. Now we're going to the opposite bolt. So I'm gonna go around one more time just to double check that I did get all these bolts torqued down properly and the rotor didn't shift at all on the hub. All right, we just got done installing the new G-Brakes rotor here. We decided to go with the black carrier, the red buttons. Looks really good on this bike. It's always a great color combo. If you have any questions on fitment, install, please feel free to head to our website or give us a call. All our information is on our website. Go to gbrakes.com.